Do you, Prince Naveen, take Tiana as your lawfully wedded wife? I sure do. Because we're adults. And you know what that means. Like, we're for adults only. This is an adults only channel, always has been. I'm just a gay man playing with some dolls right now. But it's so that adult collectors, gift givers, etc. can come to my channel, get informed about products, and decide for themselves if they want to buy them. And I think that's a beautiful marriage. So yes, my channel is for adults only. It is not for children. Um, and adults keep on watching. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Um, today, we are gonna be unboxing some Tiana from the Princess and the Frog dolls that are from the Disney store. Um, this wedding set I've had for a while. I was very impatient and I bought it from the UK Disney store because I always forget that stuff that's at the UK Disney store first ends up here in the States. So I bought her, um, yeah, and paid for that international shipping. But I just wanted this set really, really bad because she has pointed feet and I love this dress and everything. The only thing I'm kind of bummed out about is it doesn't have like the little hand gloves that she has in the movie, but that's fine. Other than that, it's pretty accurate. And then I saw this pop up on Instagram and um, it's Tiana in a different outfit and who doesn't, you know, that's simple doll logic. You buy a whole entire set so you can get the one different outfit because for some reason, so many of us doll collectors, we, um, we love the outfits, but we refuse to sew our own. So anyway, um, that's just me calling myself out because I need to start sewing and I could have a lot more aerial dresses. Like I could finally get that aerial dress from the end of the movie where she's like walking up and King Triton lets her be a human, that like silvery lavender kind of situation. That is a super cute doll. But yeah, why don't we get these guys out of the box and get a closer look? And I guess we'll start with the wedding set. Oh, shit, you know what that hurt? Ooh, girl, all right. Well, it's the Disney store's fault. I guess it's not Tiana's. Um, there's an ass ton of glitter all over her and it is getting all over my fingers and all over my desk. But this wedding set is cute and that veil, it's, while it is like, pretty cheapy. They didn't skip out on like material. Like it goes down past her butt and I love that. And then the wedding dress is layered and beautiful and it's full of details. The only thing that's missing, like I said, are just her little hand gloves and that's totally fine. And then Prince Naveen is in his royal wedding outfit and I love that because I only have Naveen in the small prince outfit. So having another Naveen doll is fantastic. And yeah. He just, the way they put that look on him, he just looks like he's so in love with Tiana. And then Tiana has some really pretty makeup on, like some gold eyeshadow and everything. And I think it's really cute. But yeah, there's no stand or anything, which is totally fine. But the details are absolutely crazy. And we're gonna have Tiana lay down for a second so I can show you Prince Naveen's articulation. I can get this freaking glitter off me. So his head moves from side to side. It doesn't go up and down. Um, and then his shoulders go back and forward out. And then he has articulation in the elbows, just not in the wrists. And then he can go forward and backward. And then his legs can go out and to the side. And then he has a bend and snap knee and no articulation in the ankle, which is standard like male doll Disney store articulation. And I'm totally fine with that. And you know, his outfit has some really good details and everything, especially considering like, I don't think the set was that much. I think it was maybe like $30, right? And it still comes with like two dolls with a ton of detail and it's, you know, everything. So I like that, but Naveen's gonna sit down now and we're gonna focus on the star of the show, Miss Tiana in her um, actual wedding dress, like when they go back to New Orleans and get married. And she has the standard like Disney store doll articulation right now where it's the head goes up and down and side to side. The shoulders go 
backwards, forwards, out and in. Then she has articulation at the elbow and wrist. Um, they do have the legs that can go forward and backward. She has the bend and snap knee and then no articulation in the ankle, but it's fine because she has the flat foot and it's stretchy. Like there's enough like pliability down here that you can do stuff with it. It just won't stay in that position, but yeah. And then the dress is just crazy. She's got like a little flower, tons of glitter that's just getting everywhere, but whatever, like you can't win them all. And then she has like her little bouquet um, that they have as like a corsage on her wrist. And then just the material they use for the dress is super pretty. It's kind of delicate though. Um, and then there's like layers underneath and I love that. Um, some of Tiana's hair is coming out. I can like see it in the veil and underneath the dress and everything. And that's okay. Um, but her face is like really cute. She has good makeup and everything, big bright eyes, stuff like that. So I do like her. Um, and I, you know, Tiana's like in my top three favorite Disney princesses. And so anytime there's like a new doll or version of her, I can't help myself, especially since I think she needs more love than she gets. But I feel the same way with like Pocahontas because she's also in my top three. Ariel gets tons of love. Like she's definitely like a fan favorite. But yeah, these two are super cute. And I think it's time to unbox the um, Tiana in her restaurant like playset. All right, guys, and here is Tiana outside of the box. We're gonna give you a closer look at the details on these dolls, but I just wanna show you like what the play, like the play set comes with. So first of all is this cute little like paperboard pulled out of uh, Tiana's place and it looks like the menu. But then on the back, she has a picture of her, her mother and her dad. And it's like just the cutest picture. I love this so much. It makes me so happy. And we'll, we'll get a closer look at that. And then she has a dessert cart that um, comes with a little dish and you can take it off and it reveals like a kind of cake that Tiana made. And you know, she's presenting it to her guests. And I think that's super cute. And then it comes with like this little cook station and there's like a little jar of flour, there's a rolling pin, um, a whisk and a bowl to mix up stuff, and then a huge uh, gumbo pot and a wooden spoon to mix it up in. And then you can actually open up like the little cabinet and the oven. And I think that's really cute. But we'll give you guys a closer look at everything so we can get a better idea of the details. And then she has the standard playline articulation as well, mentioned earlier in this video. But she has the good kind of glitter that doesn't wipe off of the dress or anything. She's wearing like a weird tiara. And then we, we've all seen this outfit at the end of the movie where she's kind of like doing the Charleston with Prince Naveen on the roof. So let's bring you in so you guys can get a better look. So here's Tiana's little kitchen. Um, there's the flower pot, the rolling pin, all of that, the cute little oven, everything just so adorable. And then here is Tiana and she's wearing that weird little tiara, super cute makeup. They didn't like lighten up her skin or anything. I love that. And then there's her outfit. She does have those weird little flat foot shoes. And then there's the cart with the little dessert. And then this is what I was excited to show you guys up close. It's that cute little family portrait on the back of the menu. I love that. Then here is Tiana in her wedding dress. There's her tiara, her cute makeup, the details, all that glitter that's like picking up on my ring light. Like that is super pretty on the ring light and everything, but it is getting everywhere. And then her dress just comes like all the way down and then she has pointed feet, high heels. And then there's Prince Naveen, his little handsome royal outfit. And then he just has like that standard, like kind of rubbery black boot that the princes all get. And then yeah, there's his hair from the side. And yeah, he's super handsome. 
but these are super cute. I love Disney store quality dolls. Um, let me know if you like Disney store quality dolls down in the bottom. And then don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you very much, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.